Okay, how many of you know somebody who has been affected by colon cancer? Uh, colon cancer is the third leading cause of cancer-related deaths and is estimated to cause 50,000 deaths in this year, 2018. Um, my dad was diagnosed with colon cancer in 2016 and is still currently battling it. I think it's important for all of us to know what we can do in order to catch this disease in its early stages before it spreads. I will, dis I will discuss um, what it's like to have colon cancer, um, the organization that can help save lives, and um, how successfully they use their resources. I will begin with um, an insight on colon cancer. According to Brawley American Cancer Society's publication 2018, um, the overall um, survival, the overall five year survival rate of colon cancer is 64%. And um, if caught as at its localized stage, the early stages, it's gonna be um, 91%. Uh, five-year survival rate, and once that spreads to the organs and tissues and lymph nodes, that's going to go down to 72% survival rate, and at its last stage, um, where it spreads to distant parts of the body, you have a 14% of survival rate in five years. Um, uh, colon cancer uh, is diagnosed uh, to about 140,000 people per year, and uh, 50,000 are estimated to die from it. Um, according to Khan, Pure and Applied Biology 2015, um, some symptoms of colon cancer involve uh, constipation, um, lack of appetite, which is found in 80% of all patients, um, uh, diarrhea, lack of energy, um, blood in stool, abdominal pains, um, bowel changes, and um, it can also result in weight loss, hemorrhoids, inflammation in colon, and irritable bowel syndrome. So now that we know a little bit more about colon cancer, we're going to move on to the organization that helps prevent it altogether. Uh, called the Colon Cancer Collision. So according to Ann Car Carlson, um, this organization was founded by Kristen Lindquist in 2004 when she lost her sister to colon cancer. She started this run called Get Your Rear in Gear. And um, what started off as one woman's vision became a group of people who were purely dedicated to um, to uh, help spread awareness by um, uh, screenings, um, education, and awareness. Um, and their goal is to help people understand the risk factors of colon cancer and to get the right screening at the right time. Um, according to Peterson, uh, Colon Cancer Coalition 2015. Um, this, uh, this organization has three main goals, and that is raising awareness. And they do this um, by uh, providing outlets for all the people who have been affected by cancer so that they can share their stories and um, share how important it is to get a screening. Um, they also have a very important goal to raise the screening rates by a certain percent, which I'll get more into in the next slide. And then local funds, which um, wherever they raise money in, it goes back to the community that their event was held in and goes to programs to help educate and provide screenings. Um, and they raised $1 million last year. Um, and now that I've talked about um, 
the uh, foundation, I'll be talking about the outcome if you were to donate to it. So according to Fenn, um, from MedPage, 2008, uh, the overall success rate of, oh, and charity um, navigator, the overall success rate of this foundation is 86%, and that's 81% in their financial and 100% of accountability and transparency. Um, and the colonoscopy success rate overall reaches 94%. Um, is this charity quantitative or qualitative? It's quantitative because of the rates um, that they measure for their screenings. And their main goal is to raise screening rates up to 80% um, by the end of 2018. Um, which would mean that they saved 200,000 lives in the year of 2018. Um, because it's a preventative cancer and the screenings can help with that. Okay, um, I, hopefully now you know more about colon cancer and how to prevent it. Um, I discussed what colon cancer is, um, the foundation that helps to prevent it and the um, success, how successfully they use their resources. Um, it is important for us to um, know what we can do in order to uh, catch colon cancer in its early stages and prevent it from spreading. Um, if you like to, if you like more information, you can go to coloncancercoalition.org. Thank you.